Hi, I'm CK at CK Education with today's Advice for Life. Are college internships important? I mean, do I have to have an internship? What if I don't have one? Um, does it have to be an internship? Can I just get a regular job somewhere else, just working part-time somewhere else? I get questions like this. Um, now, there's, of course, it's, it's not like you have to have an internship to get a career job. That's not true, of course. But I think that if possible, if you know what you want to do, if you know um, what area specifically you want to go into and internship opportunities are there, I think it doesn't hurt. I think it's advantageous to have internships. If you want to go into investment banking or finance or let's just, I'm just using this as an example, but let's say something in business like that and you have internships that are available, you can go do an internship at Merrill Lynch or Charles Schwab or Fidelity or Vanguard or Leg Mason or Tiro Price or whatever, you know, if you can do something like that, then I think that's, that's great because I've seen students in their junior years uh, and, and, you know, going into their senior year, um, you know, get internships and they, this is sort of a, a prolonged internship. And I've seen those internships lead to career um, uh, uh, positions. And so I, I think that's a, a great way to, you know, sort of kickstart your career because understand that once you get into college, your career prep has begun. A lot of students take this wrong mindset of, oh, when I get into college, this is four years of a school, additional schooling. And then once schooling's done, then I'll think about my career. No, once you get into college, you got to start thinking about your career right away. You got to start prepping for it. So even if you don't get an internship, and I think, like I said, it's great if you can get something in your area. But even if you cannot or do not, I would work. So when I tell people, I've told people for many years and I, I've made many videos on this, but... I always recommend that college students work 15 to 20 hours, something like that, you know, part time. And it doesn't have to be necessarily in the field that you want to go into. It could be at, you know, whatever, Target, Starbucks, it doesn't matter. But the thing is, you want to work and you want to show that you work and it builds responsibility and maturity and, and so forth. Uh, but it also builds your resume. And so I think it's important to do some kind of work, even if it's not in the exact field that you intend to go into. OK, now, again, if you can work in the field that you you want to go into after college, then even better. But sometimes that's not always possible. But if it's not, work somewhere else. Um, and if, if for no other reason than to work 15, 20 hours and make eight to ten thousand dollars a year and pay your own tuition, you know, and, and or at least part of it. So I think uh, if you could, you could do that and it helps you to manage your uh, money wisely. I think that if you work and you uh, pay at least for partially, at least for your uh, tuition, I think you become more motivated, more accountable, more responsible, more mature. And uh, I've seen kids just get much more uh, serious about school because uh, they work. Part of their money that they work for goes into paying their tuition. I think they're much more motivated to do well and they take school seriously. So for parents, I think this is a great idea that I would tell, you know, your kids. Um, so, uh, but do you have to have an internship? Of course not. But I would do some kind of work while you're in college. I think that's important. And I think it leads, it leads to other opportunities. And at, and at the least, it helps to build your resume. So I think that's a good idea. I'm CK of CK Education. Thanks for watching. And until my next video, I hope you stay well.